Hi, welcome to Michael's Adventures. I'm Michael. Today I'm going to get my eyes checked. And the reason why is because my eyesight is failing. So I might need to get those checked. And I also, I'm also supposed to get new glasses and also the extra ones so the problem is that I might have a multiple personality disorder why? because because I'm sort of like a fashion guru slash teacher's pet slash nerd. And, and the only glasses that might fit me is from one of my favorite TV nerds. And it's Betty Suarez from Ugly Betty. I mean, you guys might like this one girl, Jess, from New Girl. But I think Jess is more of a tomboy. And, and she may coin the term adorkable. But, but Betty Suarez is the one with the glasses and braces and frizzy hair. And, and she and I both like beauty stuff. I mean, at Five Below, they have a new aisle for cosmetics. And I was over the moon. I mean, it's like, it's like finding something for my study skills. So there, I must have been a dorkable. Yeah. Coming from a guy who sounds like he's interested in my little pony. But but I'm also but I'm also athletic. I mean, I just got this form for my team in basketball. And And the card would say that I can't seem to figure out which loud I'm related to. I mean, I'm pretty sure it may be a cross between Lynn, Lisa, Lori and Lenny and also and also more of uh, Luna and also Lola need to ask you guys one question what should what glasses should I wear 
a nerd who likes beauty, general nerd, or fashionable. Or the one for multi personality disorder. So I'm getting lunch before I get my eyes checked and and I think I'm hungry like a wolf. So we're eating at my favorite fast food joint. Talk about Yeah, I told her Yoki Avo Taco Bell. That's my mom's order. And those are my orders. Yeah. Yo quiero Taco Bell? Well, my slogan is Nobody lay a finger on my burritos. Do. So I'm going to get my eyes exam and and I'm going to show you guys a bit of a checkup. And then I'll I'll find my glasses, the new ones. So I hope I'm going to love them. Directly at the little house. Mm -hmm. I'll get the left eye. See, this one's not nearly as scary, is it? No. There you go. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And thank you for being patient with me. I... Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Sometimes I'm very. I think I'm funny, and apparently I'm not. So I'm very sorry about next door because. Um, oh no, you're fine. Because as you can see, she said she's gonna blast my eyes out with air, and I was like, "What? You're gonna blast my eyes out? How could you?" Sorry. Well, typically we don't blast people, so I should yes. not have said it that way. Yes, yeah, she used the wrong terminology, and that scared the crud out of me. I am very sorry for you kids. <laughs> uh, hopefully the, oh, there won't be any kids until this afternoon, I hope. I, uh, he's talking to one on his blog that's Oh, watching. I'm sorry. It's yeah. okay. Yeah, y'all kids can um, stay if you want. But I'm very sorry about... Like I said, I was very sorry about being scared because she used the wrong terminology. Okay, May I have your glasses so that I can read your old prescription? Yeah. Thank you. And and to make it up for the kids, I was watching a, a picture of an old farmhouse. And for the farsightedness, which is called um, I think it's called presbyopia. Yeah, presbyopia. Um, yeah, I was trying to remember. And nearsightedness is myopia. Yep, myopia. I just like the simple terms. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but what year since his last eye exam, give or take? Uh, a eight. decade. A decade. Oh, eight. oh, eight? Okay. Yeah. And the and the farmhouse looks like, I mean, looks like um, SpongeBob SquarePants' is home. And I was like, wow, that looks like SpongeBob's house. Where's the monument? Where's where's the rock? Where's the Krusty Krab? Yeah. Examination room and... And the ophthalmologist, which is an eye doctor, is going to ask me to take off my glasses and put this thing on me, which is this. And he's going to show me some slides to test my eyes. And and due to time constraints, I'm going to catch you guys up in the glasses room. All right, see y'all. So he's going to ask me to cover my eyes like these just to check my I. This is one of my <laughs> glasses. The, so with the nine, just so you know, so nine it's going to be like a fashion show. A specific manufacturer. Here's Michael with his Donish. Uh, uh, 
Outstanding, astonishing. Yeah, looking GQ, Michael. And here's Michael with his other pair of glasses. Made in, made by Max. Um, So I came back from the eye doctor and and it proved that I needed new glasses and and those are the ones I wear and Those are my backup glasses. And as a result, now I can see better without any glares or blurriness. So the eye doctor just tested my vision on my 2020 vision. And it turns out um, it really was failing. And, and now I got myself new glasses. So now I'm, now I hope I would look very GQ in college. And maybe I would be discovered to be a supermodel. Let's hope my friends won't call me Four Eyes or Coke Bottles. I'm Michael. That's all for this edition of Michael's Adventures. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Michael's Adventures. Thanks for watching. Here's looking Bye. at. Here's looking at you, adventurers. Hello, I must be going.